Alright guys, the MLS playoffs are here, and let's check out how this year's playoffs are lined up. Starting with the Eastern Conference, all six teams secured playoff berths going into Decision Day, but there were no changes afterward and the seedings were unaffected. So we have the third seed is Chicago Fire who will host the sixth seed in New York Red Bulls, and the newly formed team Atlanta United FC has made the playoffs in their first season. They are the fourth seeded team and will host the fifth seed Columbus Crew SC in the one game knockout round. Then for the first seed, who are the Supporter Shield winners and has also proven to be the best squad in MLS history by setting a new regular season record with 69 points, my team, Toronto FC, who are also last year's Eastern Conference champions and MLS Cup finalists, will await the lower seeded team to advance for the two-legged aggregate semifinal. And the number two seed, New York City FC, who are also awarded a bye to the semis, will face the higher seeded team to advance from the knockout round. Moving on to the Western Conference, where there was a lot of movement after decision day, Let's start with the first seeded Portland Timbers, who claimed first place in the conference by beating the Vancouver Whitecaps FC and hoisted the Cascadia Cup in front of their rivals. They will now face a lower seeded team that advances from the knockout round. And so that win allowed the other Cascadia rival and defending MLS Cup champions the number 2 seed Seattle Sounders FC to move past Vancouver as well to earn the bye after their big win on decision day. So Seattle will face the higher seeded team to advance from the knockout round in the conference semis. Vancouver was first place going into decision day, but dropped down to the third seed and will have to play a game in the knockout round, hosting the sixth seeded San Jose Earthquakes who got a decisive win to secure their spot in the playoffs. And finally, the Houston Dynamo got a huge win to sneak past Sporting Kansas City after their loss on decision day, which gave Houston the rights to home field advantage in their knockout round matchup. So I hope you enjoyed the MLS playoffs and I'll see you after the final. Thanks so much for watching, please like and subscribe and I hope to see you in the next episode.